Hello everyone, live from my game room, it is time for the first ever Stuckey's Racing Corner, as I will be talking not only about dirt track racing, I might be talking about asphalt racing, NASCAR racing, and many more, and most of all, I'll be talking about the local tracks and the tracks on my Oh Yeah Tour, it will be awesome season this year i can feel some upsets some underdogs and some repeats of winners in dirt track racing you got some great um dirt track race car drivers you'll have new ones you'll have young ones you'll have old ones you'll have legendary but it'll be a great year of dirt track racing and i can feel the excitement as it's coming up in a few weeks and this week we're going to talk about Timberline Speedway in Corley, Texas. Um, my home track. Billy and Kim White has did an awesome job during the off season. They made some improvements to the track. They built some stuff. They made a fitry lane right in front of the grandstand. So now the fans can see the fitry lane winners up close in person person and um it'll be some awesome races you have the 305 factory stock you got the return of the super stocks you got the limited modified modifieds this year and there'll be many more classes at timberline and michael lynch is the promoter he's I know he'll do an awesome job. He did an awesome job the end of the season when he took over. But it's a lot of action and excitement. And if you've never been to a dirt track racing, come on this year, whether it's Timberline Speedway or your local tracks around your area. It's a fun field and excitement and a family atmosphere. You meet some great drivers. You meet some awesome fans. Some pit crews um, have some good old home cooking from nachos to hamburgers to hot dogs. Great photography. And this year, Maddie's photography. Uh, her, Maddie, and Ricky Smallwood does an awesome job at Timberline Speedway. And they do an excellent job. They're there every week. And um, it'll be a lot of fun. You got Justin Whitehead, who um, is putting on the second annual Factory Stop 50, which should be an awesome event because the Super Stocks will be involved this year. Last year, it was over 100 Factory Stocks, and hopefully there will be a lot more, maybe up to 200 cars and 200 Factory Stocks. Not counting the Super Stocks, which racing for... Uh, quite a bit of money, I think over a thousand dollars or more, and hopefully there'll be over a hundred of them. And there was a packed house at last year, uh, standing room only. I give props to the Whiteheads; they did an awesome job giving away stuff for the to the race car drivers. And man, it was lined up to sixty-seven speedway. So um. And that will be in a couple weeks, in a little over a month, I think. But uh, Justin Whitehead's um, real good at being involved in um, making some of the racing good and coming up with an event, too. He did an awesome job with that Factory Stop 50. Everyone had fun. Um, they help each other. And Dustin Taylor Hyde, I heard he built a new modified car or an outlaw modified. So I can't wait to see him. And there's a lot more race car drivers. Dustin Robnett, I think, coming back into super stock again. I've seen pictures of it. And Justin Matt Daniel, you got Marcus Cottle, Brian Mewborn. Um, you got them, um, and a lot of them, Aaron and Adam Roy, get to see them back in that zone. Uh, Adam Roy has a whole new rap that looked pretty cool. 
And um, Sean Graham, he last couple of weeks ago uh, built him a station wagon, and uh, he'll be coming. And you get to see Doug Fitt Jr. and all of them, and many more race car drivers. And you will have some a lot of fun out there and get to meet some awesome drivers. And if you came last year, keep coming because there will be more, bigger and better stuff each year in Dirt Track and a lot more fun. And this is my first ever Stucky's Racing Corner and I hope you enjoy it. I can't wait to see Seth Clark back at announcing. He's doing an awesome job and can't wait to see all my old friends, family, and fans and also uh when you go to the star trek racing tell them danny stuckey sent you and give them an oh yeah